B.O.B. Eyewitness News 4 at 6. They should actually get the, the city buses more cleaner. It's a story sure to make your skin crawl. A woman says she got more than just a ride home on a city bus. The woman says when she got off the bus, she could tell right away something wasn't right. What she says she found may make you cringe. Our Chris Ramirez went looking for answers. New at 6, he's live tonight near Rio Grande and Central. Chris. And you know, Tom and Nicole, our city buses attract a wide range of people from the old to the young, from the east side to the west side. Well, we talked to a woman this afternoon who claims that somebody brought bed bugs onto a bus and somehow they jumped onto her. I take it every day to where my appointments, her appointments. I take it to my mom's. For Michelle Brooks, city buses are a necessity, and up until about three weeks ago, everything seemed to be going fine. I got off Central Bus to walk to my mom's, and I started getting bit on my side and my stomach. And I went and checked my clothes, didn't see nothing. My mom, I picked up my shirt like that to show her, and there was actually a bed bug on my shirt that she saw. Michelle says three times total now she has gotten off the city bus and had these bites on her arms and on her stomach. And with Michelle's active three-year-old, I can't run! Michelle says she now worries her daughter may get bed bugs too. Now we took these allegations to the city transit department and they say, hold on. They get 13 million passengers each year and a lot of complaints, but bed bugs is a first for them. And there's a good, good chance that that person probably received transmission of those bugs elsewhere. Transit spokesman Rick DeRea says buses are swept and picked up nightly and sanitized with bleach water once every couple of months. But he hadn't heard of Michelle's complaints if he had. If something like that were to happen, they'd have to scrub that bus completely. But how would we know where to look if we've never received a complaint in the first place? Michelle is certain her bug bites originated from a bus. They should actually get the city buses more cleaner. No one can really prove one way or another, but if they did, Michelle is hoping they don't get off with her at her bus stop anymore. Now, Michelle Brooks says that she did file a complaint. Transit, as you heard, says that they never saw it. Uh, but they do say if this has ever happened to you, make sure you take note of what bus you're on so they can look into it, and if need be, they can clean it. We're live in southwest Albuquerque for you tonight. Chris Ramirez, KOBI Witness News 4.